and welcome back. Um, today, I'm gonna share with you guys the biggest news um, from Disney. There's a big news just coming from all the Disney parks all over the world, and as you guys have been watching my series of videos here, I've been doing videos to help you guys see what's there, what's out there, um, and I hope you guys are appreciating some of this stuff. Um, let me know if, if you guys want me to do something, and I'll go see if I can try to check it out. Um, cool. If I am missing something, leave me a comment below. If you're a brand new subscriber, brand new viewer, consider subscribing. Um, and if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Um, we always try to cover everything that we can here on this channel. So anything that comes to traveling. Okay, let's start with Shanghai. As you guys know, Shanghai is a huge park, Disneyland. They're, they, they just opened up Zootopia. It is like it has and the biggest anticipated ride is called Hot Pursuit where you can ride up a, a police car and chase the bad guys pretty much. I didn't get a chance to check it out yet. I was already gone. Um, but I hear a lot of great things for that ride. And there's more there's more stuff coming that I haven't heard of yet. But they there's like slots saying coming soon, but there's no what it is. Um, they also have a new hotel that's coming to have views of Disneyland of over 400 rooms. It's going to be located at the Wishing, uh, Wishing Star Lake. Um, so yeah, just more room. Uh, the, the hotels always sell out. When I was there, the hotels were sold out and the park wasn't packed. And it's just one big park. So I'm just like, man, at the fireworks, there's a lot of people though. I was just like, geez. So yeah, hopefully they build another park too. But I know there's a lot of stuff that they're planning. It is the newest Disney park. Um, newest Disney location. So make sure you do check this one out. Okay, Hong Kong, next one. World of Frozen, which just came out recently. Um, couple new rides and it's gonna, and will bring you pretty much into the movie. Um, this is like the largest expansion of Hong Kong to date. They haven't, they've done a couple things here and there, but nothing like major. Um, when I was there, they had some of the construction going. I could see the top, I'm like, ooh, like it's there. But again, I was already gone by the time it came out. So I was like, Dang it. Um, they are looking to build more stuff. They, there is a lot of planning because they do have some room in there to do a lot of stuff in there. So there's a lot of talks about what's coming, um, but that is the biggest one that Hong Kong has. Hopefully they do some more stuff because Hong Kong um, is lacking on a lot of stuff. So, okay, next one, Paris, Disneyland. Um, they have the Disney Sym uh, Symphony of Colors. Uh, the new drone fireworks show, not to replace the main the main fireworks, but they're going to be doing an addition of it. Um, it was cool. I thought it was pretty neat how they did everything. So they're going to be adding more stuff to it, making it bigger, better, uh, which should be great. Um, they're going to be also adding the Osaka o Osoka in Star Wars. It's going to be added to the storyline in that in um, in Star Tours. I'm sorry. So they're going to add another storyline to Star Wars. There you go. <laughs> um, they're also going to be doing uh, the Disney Hotel. It's going to go through major renovations. As you guys know, the Olympics is coming. Um, and anytime any place has Olympics of any sorts, they just do a lot of upgrades. So Disney's getting a huge upgrade on their thing. Now, with the other park, the studios, Hollywood Studios, Kingdom of Arendelle, like Hong Kong, is coming in 2025. Um, we don't know too much about it. We know there's going to be like three more attractions. I think like um one restaurant uh, a merch store and then like two uh snack places um so it's going to be a good small little land that they're doing um i kind of wish it's going to be one big ride and two smaller rides i wish they would do like one big ride a medium ride and then two smaller rides so we'll see um they recently opened up avengers campus with a bunch of new rides i actually love that area it was really nice what they did so I'm pretty stoked um on on all the new updates that's coming Okay, uh, Tokyo. Tokyo, they got Disney Sea, or I'm sorry, Disneyland. We're, we're gonna stick to Disneyland first. Space Mountain is getting an upgrade. And I mean, they're gonna be getting a good upgrade. Um, I don't know what they're doing exactly with it yet. I don't know if they're gonna be turning it hyperspace or if they're gonna be adding Star Wars or what they're doing, but I know they're adding some kind of upgrade coming soon. Disney Sea, Fantasy Springs Hotel is set to open in 2024. They're also going to be building a Frozen Kingdom, Anna and Elsa's Frozen Journey, um, Rapunzel's Forest Boat Ride, and Peter Pan Land Neverland Adventures. 
I'm not really sure where they're gonna put all this stuff. Um, again, they do have the room at Disney Sea, so there is some stuff coming. So I don't know if they're gonna be taking something down and putting it up. Um, I guess we're gonna have to see, but that's what's coming soon. Okay, let's head over to Orlando, Magic Kingdom. Splash Mountain is being replaced by Tia as uh, Tiana Bayou's Adventure. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. Um, they're replacing that entire ride. I know people are going to ask me, well, what, what's, what, where can we see Splash Mountain if we want to see it? Tokyo, as of right now. I don't know if they're going to change it later, but um, you know, some rides do need updates. I do like Splash Mountain, but I'm actually very excited to see Tiana's Bayou Adventure, so we'll see how that one works. Um, Tron, very new. It just opened. It came from Shanghai. Amazing. And I mean amazing. Um, they're, they also revamped uh, Country Jamboree, which is a very old show, um, but it's going to get revamped. So make sure you guys do stay tuned for that one. Um, heading over to Orlando's Hollywood Studios, Mickey's Runaway Railway. Great ride. Um, it used to be something else. I forget what it was before, but they just put that one in, which is awesome. They also just built a whole Star Wars land, which is great. Um, you walk in there, it's just huge. I feel like they need to add some more stuff because as you're walking through, you're like, okay, here's the ride, and it's kind of like a whole bunch of nothing. Um, so I think they have some more stuff coming. Um, it's just, we're just, we just have to wait and see what they do. And then of course, for Star Tours, they're adding new scenarios though. Oh, oh, uh, they, I, can't, I can't pronounce her name, I always screw it up. Um, so yeah, a lot of cool stuff there. Um, okay, Orlando Epcot. Spaceship Earth updates are going on. They're gonna be doing some updates. Epcot Entrance, it's gonna be a new one. Um, they just opened up that Guardians Rewind ride, which was incredible. If you haven't been to it yet, you have to. Brand new ride, just came out. Make sure you guys do check that one out. They also just opened something called Moana's Journey of Water. Go at night. Daytime it's cool because it's when it's hot especially you want to go there and cool down because there's some misters and some water splashing and stuff um but honestly at nighttime the feel the vibe there is just it's awesome like you know you see here it's just really really cool um they're always adding some new festivals always adding some new foods wines like all that stuff in epcot and they just updated a lot of new parks um like for a lot, a lot of new rides like frozen frozen is is a new ride that they just added there in orlando um epcot so Pretty nice. Okay, uh, Animal Kingdom, Orlando's Animal Kingdom Park. Finding Nemo, the show just got revamped. It's gonna be a brand new show. Um, Zootopia is going to replace the Bug Life show. I'm not sure how that's gonna look like, but we'll see. Zootopia is getting actually pretty big. And then there's rumors, this is rumors. So there's rumors coming around about a new Indiana Jones and Encanto rides those right those two just makes a lot of sense there like Indiana Jones cool like I, I wonder if they're gonna add I don't think they're gonna add like the real animals within the rides but it would be cool to see some of animatronics or some screens or something I hope it's not like Indiana Jones how California is I just hope it's something completely new and great so and and Canto I'm actually interested to see what they're gonna do with that too so at the animal kingdom out of all places okay California, we're heading over to California, the Disneyland Park. Splash Mountain is gonna be replaced again by Tiana's Bayou Adventure. Um, and you already heard how I feel about it. And then Star Wars, Star Tours, again, they're also adding the new scenarios. They're not really doing much besides the new ride, um, but that's, that's what they have going on right now. California Adventures, there's a, re, there's a full revamp going on. They just opened up San Francisco um, that just opened, you know, with Baymax and all them, um, Big Hero 6. And then there's rumors, big rumors happening about Frozen or and or and or Zootopia. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. There's 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 been so much happening with that park and all these updates and they're changing the lands. They're trying to make it more like Pixar more of the other studios not just like the original disneyland parks but like they're adding some more like you know the, they got the marvel campus they got some of the pixar stuff happening um just a lot of like updates and, and a lot of um you know to what's relevant with what disney is doing so i hope they do add frozen in there i hope they do add zootopia Z zootopia is very underrated um, it's funny because some people think like oh zootopia is cool but it's not big but when zootopia came out to shanghai 
like there's people dressed up as Zootopia characters, you know? Um, so I think it's gonna do really well if it does come to California Adventures. Um, it's a process of what they're doing. Um, so we'll see. Th this is all the stuff that's coming soon. If there is something that I'm missing, leave me a comment below. Let me know what you might have heard. Let me know if there's uh, like confirmed, like, hey, I just heard that they're gonna be building this new ride here at this park in this country or, or you know wherever let me know where yeah i'm i'm excited i'm excited i just finished doing a whole tour around the world looking at all the parks and i'm i'm excited to see all the new updates and these aren't little updates these are major updates so cool let me know in the comment section below hope you guys appreciate today's episode as always you guys know i'm always traveling and doing all kinds of stuff here um if there's anything else that you guys want to see let me know um, I'm gonna be adding some more food stuff because I know people have been asking. We need more food videos. Like we want to see what's good, what's not good when you're going to these places. So coming soon, um, you know, always evolving. Hope you guys are doing well. New year, crazy. Um, and yeah, I always, always like to hear from you guys when you guys are, are posting comments and stuff. So with all that being said, you guys take care, take care of each other. See you guys in the next one.